All right, so we're gonna do mission 14 for you. So for this one, we want to ride the card on the far left. And we do not want to stride. Now, just to get it out of the way, we'll go ahead and seek tomato. Put as many copies of his uh, grade two in as you can. His grade two is essentially just a clone of a guano gourd. So when it gets retired, you can uh, counter blast one to bring it back to the field. Now, we'll go ahead and move this guy to the back row. We'll call this Dinobot over here. His effect is when he attacks, you can sack a Dinobot, give him plus 5k, and when he hits, you can unflip a damage. We're going to call this Grade 3 over Dino Quad over here because the Grade 3 can hit without being boosted. So that gives us the out to do all of the shenanigans that we need to do here. So first, we're going to attack with the 11k. Then we're going to attack with the grade 2. Both of these attacks are going to be unboosted because they can both hit the vanguard without being boosted and we need both of the boosts for later. We're going to sack the starter. The starter's effect triggers. The starter allows us to counter blast one and search for a copy of either our vanguard or our legion mate on the vanguard circle and call it the rear guard. So we're going to search for a copy of our grade 2 and we're going to call it over here. After that, his skill triggers, and then we get to unflip one, even though it doesn't really matter in context here. We're going to smack them upside the head with our 16k row over here. Now, when the Vanguard attacks, he gets to sack one to gain 5,000 power. So we're going to go ahead and choose that on the Legion mate. Also, his second effect is, if he's in Legion, if he retires a unit that has the same name as a unit on his Vanguard circle, then he gets a bonus critical and 5,000 more power. Additionally, since this card is a copy of a Guano Gorg, we can counter blast one and call it the rear guard. So we're going to call it over here so that it can have the boost. And finally, we smack him in the dome for 16k, winning the game. I am Sugei and that is how you beat it.